Hey, Kegger's here with a little impromptu video. You see, we're coming to the end of Secret Invasion, and I thought, hey, let me put out my thoughts. But not my thoughts on Secret Invasion, my thoughts on what's going to be happening afterwards. You see, we're also getting close to the start of Armor Wars, in which case we're going to be having Rhodey himself starring in his own show. Which is good, because they really haven't given him as much stuff to do as I really would have hoped they've given him. And... Now that we know the whole scroll thing going on with him, I have the idea that, well, Armor Wars is probably going to be about him rebuilding his reputation after being taken over by his scrolls for about probably two years, I'm guessing. It can't have been too long because they would be pissing off too many people if it was revealed that he'd been a scroll since like Iron Man 1 or Iron Man 2. So no, it had to have happened either during or after, probably after the blip, after everything was super confused, he got swapped out. Yeah. So, um, he's Rhodey. Give me a moment. And we're back. And so is James Rhodes. So yeah, he's going to be rebuilding his reputation, probably security clearances and other stuff has been like going completely out the wayside. He's lost all, like people have lost all respect for him and all the things he's done. Who was the scroll? When did he do the thing? Yada, 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 all that stuff. So he's going to be going around. He's going to be um, possibly collecting armor tech, which had been uh, spread out to various corporations. I don't know. That's what the whole thing was in the comics, but that was more Tony Stark stuff. But Tony Stark's gone, so it's all up to James Rose to handle things. I do have one question. How are they really going to be doing an Iron Man show? I mean, like... The Iron Man stuff has sort of been on the high end of their expensive stuff. So him flying around in a suit of armor, blowing stuff up, might be a little bit much for a Disney Plus budget. I'm wondering who's going to... Happy! We might get Happy Hogan back. We might get, um, you know, we might get Gwyneth and Paltrow. We, we might get Pepper. We might get all of the Iron Man supporting cast, which would be good because we haven't seen these guys since... Um, happy in No Way Home. That's pretty much the last time we saw any of them. We haven't seen Morgan. We haven't seen Pepper. So, yeah, I'll be nice seeing those guys coming back. Oh, my God. Justin Hammer. We're probably going to be seeing Justin Hammer coming back. We're, we're probably going to be seeing Justin Hammer coming back, and, like, that's going to be great. He is an incredibly underrated Iron Man movie character. He's just hilarious to see all the time, so I'm hoping Justin Hammer is going to be the main antagonist of Iron of Armor Wars. Yeah, these are just some random wandering thoughts, some stuff I want to get out there. Um, actual video will be later on, but this is just this is just me, me to you, just talking, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.